Hi guys, this is Miss Kathy and Youth Services. I'm doing Cashback Spoilers, maybe. The, st the book this month is called Tail Spinners Saving Fable by Scott Reddington. I'm going to be reading the first page and the last page of the story. The first chapter is called The Last Chance. Once a week, Indiria's story woke up early like before the sunrise early. Stars still in the sky early. I'm sure you know the feeling, my dear reader. The bed is warm, the floor is cold, even the moon watches you. One eyebrow is raised, a little unsure why anyone would get up at that hour. If you know the feeling, then you know exactly how Indiria felt as she got ready that morning. She lit a single candle in the corner of her shack and started getting dressed. It was one of those few times that having just one outfit to her name came in handy. Even in the semi-dark, she never ended up putting on mismatched clothes because there are all, only her clothes. She slid inst instinctively into a pink homespun shirt. The tunic was cinched at the waist by a well-worn leather belt, from which a silver hammer hung. Page, that was the first page. Last page. It felt good to be known like that, to see herself in this imaginary world. Penny, she wasn't certain how long she'd been reading, but Emma and the girls stood by the store's entrance. We're riding out, ready? Their stairs were almost, the stairs almost had her setting the book on the nearest shelf. She held, hesitated for just a moment and then clenched it breathlessly to in her chest. She walked straight to the register. A kind man helped her with the purchase and even slid a bookmark in it free of charge. Penny flipped to the first page and nudged Emma. You'll love the start of this book. Emma, being edgy and unpredictable, asked Penny to read it to her. She started at the beginning. Every cage has a key. That was the last page. So if this book was interesting to you, with the first page and the last page, you can stop in the library and check this out. It's called Tail Spinners Saving Fable by Scott Brennigan.